Disney's Wilderness Lodge, located right off the shores of Bay Lake and very close to the Contemporary Resort and a short boat right away from the Magic Kingdom. It's one of Disney's deluxe resorts and today I'm going to give it my full in-depth review. Themed like no other resort at Walt Disney World, Wilderness Lodge is themed after the Old Faithful Lodge at Yellowstone National Park. You can tell that Disney put a lot of energy and thought into this resort. The theming is, in my opinion, one of the best at Walt Disney World with an 82 foot tall fireplace and 55 feet tall totem poles in the resort. I mean, unbelievable. As you enter Wilderness Lodge, you might be taken aback a moment, like I have in the past, and look up and just say, oh my gosh. It goes several stories high, and during the holiday season, they have a tree that sits in the middle of the lobby, and it is enormous. What do you think about Wilderness Lodge? It's amazing. Amazing. Look at those pillars go all the way up. They have like this boarding the whole thing. American flag there for me. Great resort. Amazing. Every little detail of Wilderness Lodge has been accounted for, from the hardwood floors to the timber-looking chairs to even a little geyser in the middle of the lobby. Right in the lobby, there's a geyser and a little bridge to walk over it. So cool. As you make your way outside toward the rear entrance of Wilderness Lodge, your eyes will become two times as wide as you look at this lush, beautiful landscape themed perfectly with an unbelievable waterfall and some unbelievable photo opportunities right there. That waterfall that you see outside the rear entrance of Wilderness Lodge is unbelievably beautiful and it actually feeds the pool. This is the water that they use in the pool. No need to worry about it. It's crystal clean but it's just a cool aspect to know that this is the water. You can walk over a bridge, see the water go under and then there it is in the pool. Amazing. Speaking of that pool, it's called Silver Creek Springs and it might not have the most amenities, those perks all around, but it does have some of the most amazing views as you're in the pool. It's so cool. There's another pool as well, a much quieter one near the villas which are amazing and they also have a really cool hot tub. With 727 rooms, it's one of the smaller resorts at Walt Disney World, which I think is actually a great thing, not a bad thing. In that main building, it never feels crowded. It's always really nice and empty, and you have this expansive feel with great shops, dining locations all around. Wilderness Lodge has several different room types with different views, including the standard view, nature view, courtyard view, courtyard view with the bunk bed, perfect for kids. You've got your standard room with club level access, your deluxe room with club level access, so a lot of different options for you. Along with those standard rooms at Wilderness Lodge, they also have the villas at Copper Creek and Boulder Ridge. If you're a DVC member or if you're just looking for a kitchen in your room, these might be worth looking into. I have never been personally, but looking at these pictures, you can tell Disney went above and beyond with that theming to continue it at these villas. Just looking at these pictures makes me want to try Copper Creek Villas right now. I'm telling you, it looks unbelievable. Every little detail has been themed. The lampshade, the headboard, the entranceway, and those beautiful views of Wilderness Lodge. You can't beat that. Going to Wilderness Lodge just for the dining makes sense. They have some unbelievable food from Artist Point, Geyser Point, Roaring Fork, Territory Lounge, and the Whispering Canyon Cafe. There are so many great things to try. Artist Point is the Wilderness Lodge signature service restaurant, and I went there recently, and it was so good. Hey, I've got the buffalo strip loin from Artist Point. Thanks to your votes and create the adventure with Michael. Let's give it a try together. Much more flavorful than you would think, and look, a little bit of sweetness in there. So, so good. The counter service option at Wilderness Lodge is located kind of down a long downward hallway near the rear of Wilderness Lodge, but once you make it there, they have a lot of great options available to you. Wilderness Lodge also is home to Territory Lounge, which is their resort bar if you're looking for a great place to sit back, relax, like you're in a lodge. This is in a lodge feeling right there. This is the place for you. Inside the lodge, you'll find the family service restaurant Whispering Canyon Cafe, and when I was there with my family not too long ago, my brother noticed that it wasn't exactly whispering as we walked by. David, we gotta go to Whispering Canyon. Sounds like a hopeful name. <laughs> but what name would you give it? I think Screaming or Yelling Canyon is probably more cool. Maybe. I don't want to spoil anything for anyone who wants to go and experience it, but when you're there, expect a fun family time and don't be afraid to ask for more ketchup. One of my favorite spots at Wilderness Lodge for dining is Geyser Point. They have some unbelievable food for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. The seating arrangement has changed a little bit since I went last time, but I still love it and you can still sit kind of outside near the water and enjoy your food right there. Go for that smoked salmon bialy in the morning and that bison burger in the evening. Oh my gosh, so good. That is Houston delicious. Astros. Wow. Absolutely delicious. Love it. Love smoked salmon in the no morning, way. so it's perfect. All right, let's try the bison burger together. Great flavor. Just, it's perfect. It's 
absolutely perfect. Wow. One of the greatest positives of Wilderness Lodge is the fact that it makes you feel like you're disconnected from everything. You can go, relax, you're, you're really away from a lot of the hustle and bustle that's around. But it's also one of the negatives. If you're going to Magic Kingdom, you can take a boat ride. It's very quick, easy, fun, and convenient. But if you're going to another theme park with a water park or Disney Springs, those buses have a tendency to take a little while. Yes, they do take a little bit longer, but with the implementation of the new bus tracker on your phone while you're there on the My Disney Experience app, why not sit back, relax, you can time it. As the bus gets closer and closer, you can make your way toward the bus stop and you're there. It solves the whole problem. It is an absolutely beautiful resort. I cannot recommend it highly enough. With its relaxing feel, wonderful pool, terrific restaurants, and convenient location to the Magic Kingdom, I give Wilderness Lodge an A+. I highly recommend it. So what do you think of Wilderness Lodge? Is it an A+, for you as well? Let me know right there in the poll, and don't forget to let me know your favorite part about it in the comments below. Thank you so much for being a part of the magic with me. Until next time, have a magical day.